feel about the workouts today? I feel like they, you know, they went pretty smooth. You know, just overall, just felt good getting back out there and, you know, being around and seeing a lot of old faces and, you know what I'm saying, picking back up on, you know, relationships and everything. So today as a whole was a, was a good day. How have communications been for you with the with the potential teams? You said what? Communication with teams. Have you had a lot of communications with anyone? Uh, yes, sir. You know, uh, just hearing great things about being a versatile defensive back. Some of them saying being much more of a nickel and everything like that. So getting a good word from everything that I'm hearing and, you know, just looking forward to draft day. You were predominantly an outside corner in college, right? Yeah. So what's that like transitioning inside to nickel? Like what is the team? I mean, it's pretty much second action, especially with my, you know, my quickness, lateral movements and everything like that and my breaking ability. And then also my physicality and my mentality that I play with. So moving positions around the defensive back room is pretty much, you know what I'm saying, not a problem at all, especially me having a safety background and, you know, playing those inside positions and everything like that. And then with this new defense that came in with packages as far as, you know, Don packages and everything, getting, being able to get in the nickel and stuff. So everything as a whole, you know, nothing really changes. It's just, you know what I'm saying, uh, another position for me to prevail at it, become great at it. How important has your uncle been throughout this process? Oh, it's been very important. We talked today before, you know, the, comp uh, the showcase and everything, the, pro, uh, the pro, day, pro day. So overall, just, you know, telling me the same things, be consistent, and, you know, be you at the end of the day. You know, don't try to change up anything, you know. Just continue to be the great athlete that you've been, you know, throughout the whole process and before. How important is a day like this for you? I know there was the controversy about you being left off the senior bowl roster. Having the opportunity, there were GMs, head coaches of teams here. And uh, how do you feel like, you know, you took advantage of that opportunity today? I feel like I took advantage of, advantage of it, you know, as I should have, especially with my athleticism, you know what I'm saying, my quickness and everything is, you know, my breaking abilities and then, you know, my explosiveness. So as a whole, I feel like I showed you know, some abilities that I've had, that I have, and, you know, it helps me continue to climb on boards. You said what? About play special teams. teams. Yeah, what about it? How important is it for you to show that you can play special teams? Uh, it's important, you know, especially knowing that that is uh, a side of the ball. You know, it's a, it's a momentum shifter, you know, and everything like that. So you always want to put your dogs on special teams. You always want to be able to, you know what I'm saying? Be like, this is the guy that I want to be out there running down. The guy catching balls and, you know, taking them to six. You know, guys coming down and making tackles on punt or whatever it is, you know. So as a whole, it's a, it's a big important, you know what I'm saying, part of the game. You know, you can create turnovers on, turnovers on special teams. You can get guys in the hole as far as putting them way back, you know what I'm saying, side of 10 and stuff like that. So it's a very important position in the league as well, knowing the advanced athletes that you have nowadays in the league. So, you know, it's something that I'm looking forward to. For sure. Get you a job. Yes, sir. <laughs> what does it mean to be just a part of this TCU class? Uh, it means everything, you know. It's something that everybody said means the world, but it honestly does, you know, especially me finally living out what I want, always wanted to do here at TCU as far as go to championships and, you know, have undefeated seasons and then just continue to help this program grow. And then at the end of it, you know, make sure that we're engraved, you know, here at TCU and forever. So. Just being remembered forever, man, is the main focus in this sport. And, you know, so for me to be the stepping stone of becoming that great, restarting that program over, you know, with the coach and everything like that, man, I'm just very proud to say that I was a part of that team. Yeah, there were, there were guys that are currently in the league that were here today watching you guys. Younger teammates were here supporting you guys as well. What does that say about the culture of TCU? I uh, mean, it's a family thing. You know, like they told me when I first came here, uh, when they were recruiting me, you know, TCU is a family. And it shows, you know, they came out today and showed love and, you know, kept us going, you know, and uh, just to see them on the sidelines, you know, it shows that you do have a support system, you know, so whether they're doing great things on their own, you know, they took it in for their time, you know, especially knowing that they're professional athletes, you know, they could be recovering, they could be at home, you know, getting nutrition and eating it, making sure that they're sitting on top of themselves, but instead they came out, you know, to support their former teammates and the younger generation coming up, you know, and that's, and that's what it's, you know, that's a part of the game. That's what you should do. You know, so whenever I get to that level, I'll make sure to do the same because they did it for me.